in this video we are going to talk about the surrogate key what is surrogate key what is the need for surrogate key in what situation um, uh, we have to go for the surrogate key let's take on easy easy example so where we have we are going to load the data from uh, Chennai location and Delhi location database so where it has um, a table with uh, four columns bill id date quantity and amount bill id date and quantity so where um so both the tables are having three three records with the uh, bill id one two three bill id one two three and the dates are uh, different dates and um, the data is also having a same table with the same columns bill id date quantity and amount so when we load the data from uh, uh, first from general location database the three records will be loaded and when we load the uh, data from delhi location database what happens is since uh, bill id and the data are uh, unique columns the it will check for the combination so here you can see the um, bill id is uh, unique is one two three and it will be rejected it will be uh, rejected into reject table so um uh, it won't be loaded into data warehouse table so but uh, somehow i want to load the data from uh, uh, from delhi location database into data warehouse the, how we can rectify it means so we need to uh, make the bill id as uh, uh, sequence generator number instead of loading from the source tables since these two uh, source tables are having the same uh, uh, I mean to say that it's a big duplicate um, uh, values uh, that case we have to use a sequence generator to generate the bill ID numbers so in that case so when we load from a uh, delgi load case a database the bill ID will be generated start from 4, 5, 6 and the, it loaded correctly so th th that case bill ID will be called as a um, surrogate key not a, um, a sur sur it's, it's a primary key only so but it's not loaded from the um, uh, source tables so at the end so what is a surrogate key means it's a primary key it will be loaded as part of a sequence generated or procedure not loaded from the source tables so in what situation it happens is when the source table does not have primary key else it has duplicate keys 